Afternoon goes. Yep, just double checking the clock, it is afternoon. Ooh. Well, as you may recall from previous videos, I said that the audio has stopped working on the TV. Well, because I have a very busy mind most of the time, I was laying in bed and I was I was, um, sorry about that. I was um, thinking about where to put this stereo and where I want to put it on here and I was thinking about how to set it up and, and I was thinking maybe the headphone jack on the TV would work and still give out output even if the speakers aren't but uh, that's when it dawned on me what I'd actually done. There's nothing wrong with the TV at all. Actually what is wrong is with the person that set it up me. What I've done, there's the headphone jack. I'd left the cable that connects it to the amplifier plugged in at the headphone jack. So all that was doing is cancelling out the onboard speakers. Oops. So, uh, I suppose on the bright side I don't have to, um, <laughs> I don't have to change the TVs now. Uh, So, uh, that's a bonus. <laughs> but, uh, I still haven't decided how or where or what I'm going to do with this one yet. Lots of questions, not answered. Uh, what's the time? 20 to 1. I'm just thinking of jobs I've got to do today. Clean up this shithole. That's still got to be done. I've got loads of crap to go and put in the bin. Oh yeah. oh yeah, I was taking some more things apart when I went to bed last night. Decided I didn't need all these docking stations, so I've taken two of them apart. And, um, a few interesting bits and screws and things in here. Circuitry and socket trees and jackies and all sorts of ease. Buttons. That is just a button. <laughs> I think that's the power button, that one. Anyway... I really must get my arsehole into gear. And start getting this shit cleaned up. I know Mum said she will come up and, uh... help me... clean up the place ready for my friend's visit, but, uh... if I can get most of it done... now or over the next two weeks, then it would just be a matter of scrubbing down the kitchen and the bathroom, and that's about it. Uh, most of it is just clutter. Clutter and vacuuming and a bit of dusting, that's all I've got to do. Um, I will put a fresh bag in the hoover. Because uh, uh, my friend's got allergies. I we'll need to reduce the dust and cat hair as much as possible. Because obviously the less hair and dust about, the uh, less it'll aggravate his allergies. Uh, well I've managed to have another shift around in the shed outside yesterday. So, um... I've got room to at least get to the toolbox. Mum wants to do a car boot this Friday, weather permitting, obviously, and hopefully we, she doesn't uh, call it off again, because uh, I think we all could do with doing one. Um, I'm just thinking. Oh yeah, I've got that to do as well. I've got a cabinet out on the landing, which was my old DVD and video cabinet that was sitting in there. I was going to um, upcycle it. I was going to take the two doors off and uh, trim the lid down so it meets up level with the um, 
shells at the back and make a little shelving unit out of it rather than a big bulky cabinet. Uh, there's so much I've got to do, I just don't feel motivated to do anything. We need to foot up my ass, I think, to get me to do anything. Um, the hell is in that pot down there? Oh, bike chain. And I'll find a little cubby hole to stick that. It should go down in the shed, but the shed's too full of shit at the minute. Um, no, yeah, I'll do some packing later. I've got three parcels to pack up and post. Do that tomorrow. It's not going to take a lot to pack that, is it? Should have some bubble wrap somewhere, I think. I know I've got perfect little boxes to stick it in. I'm sure yeah, I can see some bubble wrap from here. Usually I use um, carrier bags as padding in a box, but uh, I'd rather wrap that in at least a layer of bubble wrap to uh, protect it. And I've got a few bits to stick on there as well. Oh dear. Um, Get that coffee table cleared. The bollard lamp is fine where it is. I would like to clear the sofa. Uh, I know he's got his own laptop he'll bring with him. Uh, uh, mustn't lose my Wi Fi info because he'll need that while he's here. Because uh, I'm a boring fucker, so I don't really actually get up to much. Well, that I can't afford it anyway. Can't afford a pot to piss in, but never mind. I always look for things at my favourite price, free. <laughs> free or extremely cheap. <laughs> um, hello, I've got a sticker stuck on this. 69 99 cash converters. That must have been um, quite a while ago then. But I can't imagine they'd um, charge that much today for something like this, even if they take it today. I know it's got a big MP3 on there, but there is no socket to plug an MP3 player into. Unless you use a special cable and plug it into the um, AUX port on the back. You know the um, two into one or one into two, whichever way you want to look at it. Cable, which I've got a few of, so I could plug an MP3 player into it if I really wanted to. I can't see why that wouldn't work. Um, yeah, there's no docking station on this. It's just an old, just your old average CD stereo system with twin tape deck, which actually proves how old it is. As, uh, I don't think, I could be wrong, but I don't think you'd get a stereo system with a tape deck on it now. Speakers. I don't really want to put a third speaker on this, because um, it's only got two seeker, seeker jacks. Two speaker jacks, rather, not two seeker jacks. Uh... So I have known people to plug like four, five, six speakers into the back of something like this and uh, burn out the onboard amplifier. Because there's obviously more than what that's designed to handle. So your best bet, if you've got a hi-fi like this, is to actually somehow connect it to a, um audio amplifier. I'm sure you can find a way to do it with that. Make up some cables. If you had to, let's make up a couple of cables. What the hell was I going to talk about now? I can't remember. Oh dear. I'm going to have to hike out all that. Well, that's going to have to be hiked out anyway when I get the new desk in. But uh, before I put the new desk in place, I'm going to completely clean out that corner. But his cat hair tends to float here, there and everywhere. Mm. 
Mind you, it shouldn't be too bad behind this sofa because I recently had that sofa out. <coughs> oh, pardon me. I had to burp and hiccup at the same time. Uh, also got the bike out the front there to do. And one to break up and oh, oh endless list of jobs. Um I don't actually know where to start to be honest. I suppose I should start by um cleaning up the clutter up here. I think there's certain things I might as well chuck in the outside cupboards, such as that. And the box of crap up there and a few other bits. Weird hand movements for some reason, I don't think I know what I'm doing today. Uh -huh. mm. Well, that's fresh off the printer, that one. It's my repeat prescription. When I need more pills, I'll just fill that in and uh, put it in their little repeat prescriptions box and pick it up a couple of days later. Easy peasy. Right. I'm going to turn the camera off here and get on with a few bits. I won't end the video just yet in case I think of something else to talk about later. So um, all I'll say is bye-bye for now and stay tuned.